Hello, my little caffeine bats. I do apologize for not making any videos since the last video I made. <laughs> I've, you know, I've been working on walking and drinking and drinking and drinking and drinking more because, you know, protein, you gotta drink that. You can't eat that. Sorry. Yeah, uh, ugh. it's been so hard. I mean, the liquid diet is fairly easy after surgery, you know, because you don't have as much of that hungry feeling as you did before because, you know, you're used to actually eating food. But after surgery, it does get a little easier, although the smell of the good food around here, you know, does make me just a wee bit hungry on occasion. Um, other than that, you know, I'm perfectly good with it. But, um, yeah, so I found before surgery, I could tolerate the protein, you know? I was like, oh, this, oh, this is amazing, you know? Oh, I could do this, you know, perfectly fine. After surgery, I come home, you know, next day, after, you know, 10 gallons of everything in the hospital, I go and I... Uh, start, you know, drinking the protein. I I make myself a protein shake like, oh, this is easy. I take my first drink and it was like, Ugh. Ugh. yeah, I can't handle the protein powder after surgery. It's, it's like all of their flavors except the initial whey flavor of the protein has like, whoosh, while everything is gone, whoosh, it's like, ugh. But, right now, I have a protein drink that I have to choke down. I made it. It's got fruit. So it's got some mangoes, pineapples, and peaches in it. There was strawberries in that mix of fruit, but I pulled them out because I'm not allowed to have the wee little seeds. So, like, strawberries, blackberries, raspberries, you know, sort of thing. Because they can get stuck in places in your stomach, and you know, we don't we don't need that. And um, I've been I've got another week of um, Levinox shots to do, so one week of that to go. And tomorrow, you guys, tomorrow, tomorrow I find out if I can advance on to the soft foods I'm hoping I'm hoping because I've been doing really good I have um, every day I've been reaching my uh, my minimum of protein and the amount of waters that I need although the, I do start late at night with the waters because that's eight hours of water I have to drink. That's eight ounces every 15 minutes for eight hours, you guys. That's a really long time. And when I don't wake up until, you know, the late hours of the day, that's partially my fault. But, you know, it's just a really long time. And then I have to also get, like, my protein in. So I've calculated that two ounces of protein... That's 7 point grams of protein every 15 minutes for an hour to get adequate amounts. So that's 30 grams every, you know, hour. So that adds another 2 hours of drinking things onto it. So that's 10 hours of the day. That's almost half of my day right there. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's so crazy, you guys. It's... And then... Hopefully, with the mushy foods, I won't have to have as much of the protein because I'll be adding other protein-rich foods into my diet, like eggs and cottage cheese. Cottage cheese has quite a bit. <gasps> you guys, I was going to add, well, I was going to add sour cream now because sour cream does have quite a bit of uh, protein in it as it is, you know, because I've got the yogurt and I. Uh, the yogurt and a sour cream, you know, I was going to kind of every other, you know, time with those. And, oh, 
it gave me dumping syndrome. Some of you guys might know what that I mean, what that is. It's uh, basically when foods move too quick into your lower intestines, and it causes a really bad effect of like upset stomach, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea. I know TMI, but it was terrible. I'm just glad it wasn't late late dumping syndrome. Although they said if uh, foods bother your stomach now to try again in a few weeks so towards the end of this month i'll try again with the sour cream because that's one food i love i just love to eat it straight out of the container <laughs> i apologize for my teeth i do have to brush them i have to be really gentle but sometimes i don't always get it all um because the blood thinners I'm on, so if I brush them too hard, my mouth will start bleeding. It'll, uh... It's no fun, you guys. Oops, sorry. I forgot this phone does that. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's not fun, but it's also to, um, protect me after surgery from blood clots. Um... I've actually been fairly active after surgery. Um, the first two days after I came home from the hospital, I did a little bit of walking. Not much. I mean, from here to there, you know, from one of the house to the other. But um, the last several days, I have been, you know, walking outside. I've been walking around outside. I um on my Instagram, some of you guys are on my Instagram, I took some pictures of mushrooms I was excited about. There was a red one and a red and white one, excuse me, and polka dot ones, and giant ones. There was huge ones out there. I was vaguely surprised. I, want, I was thinking about going out there again today and taking more, like, trying to take better photographs, so... I'm going to get my selfie stick and kind of go out there because I'm not supposed to be bending down. So it was kind of hard last time. So I think I'm going to get the selfie stick out today and try and take more. Because it'll get me up and moving and active and stuff. And um, yeah, it'll be a good way to, uh, you know, do things. So yeah, like I said, tomorrow I find out if I advance to the soft food diet stage so I have a small list of groceries that I'm gonna need that I have to get like fat free refried beans because everything has to be fat free fat free cottage cheese um or low fat cottage cheese because there's no fat free um canned carrots because those are the easiest things to go mushy 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 num 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 nums with um and fat free cream cheese so those three things I'm going, or those several things I'm going to kind of mix around with. But uh, I could also have a small bit of uh, cheese. So I'm going to kind of incorporate that into like eggs or something. It'll be good. It'll be good. And um, uh, so some of you guys on my Instagram, I don't know how many of you are on the Instagram seen the picture I uploaded the other day where I showed the 23rd of September my bio scan I took. I was 354 pounds. And October 7th? No, that's tomorrow. Sorry, October 4th. I stepped on the scale and it said... um 333.8 so if you guys want to be updated on um my weight loss i will continue i will continue to upload on inst instagram those things when i have them out i mean because i don't always do uh youtube videos i mean i do remember that i need to do youtube videos but sometimes it's points of the day where I need to get up and move and stuff and I know I should uh, do them on the run <clears throat> do them on the run and stuff but I just I just I don't know but I do I will at least do one video a week because I know doing one every day 
is going to be a little much for me until I can find a regular schedule for everything. So I will at least do once a week. And um, I hope that's okay with you guys. And also remember that I do have that uh, Teespring store open with the cute... I, I really do enjoy that uh, design that I put on there. Um, when... When I get a chance, I want to order something from there. I wish I had I the blanket. I wanted, I made the blanket because hoping uh, later on down the road, I will have the, uh, I will have money to be able to uh, purchase the blanket because the blanket is fleece and it is absolutely adorable. I love with the, with a little coffee vampire thing on there. It's cute. Um... There's different kind of shirts, there's sweaters, there's hoodies, there's cups, there's stickers. Um, I was thinking about socks, but socks are just so difficult. Although I don't do socks. They, they're they a little, well I sometimes do uh, the slipper socks things. Because my feet get cold sometimes. Seems to be the one thing that gets cold on me a lot to, these days. <laughs> But yeah, there yeah, there's hoodies, uh, tank tops, sweaters, and stuff. There's other things I'm a sh I'm shoot I'm oh pillows. There's pillows. Well, that's one other thing I want to do. I want to get some pillows. Ah, all coffee vampire pillows. Uh, yeah. Okay, but I will have the link in the description below. Yeah. Alright, you guys. My little caffeine bats. My cute little caffeine bats. I'm going to go ahead and let you go because I do have to choke this down and then head outside so I can do some walking around because I can't just let this day go. It's so nice out there. It's actually not cold. It's not very cold out there and I want to get a few more pictures of the mushrooms before they go... Mm -hmm. All right, my little caffeine bats, you have a good day, and I will talk to you later. Mwah. Remember to be beautiful and be unique. Bye. Bye.